Peace and love, family. It's your girl, Nashe. What's up? What's good? So today, I decided I'd show you guys how I clean my thrifted items from the Goodwill and, and thrift shops. I wanted to show you how I spiritually and energetically cleanse my items before they even hit the washing machine. So normally when I get merchandise from the Goodwill or other thrift stores, I typically let it sit outside for a little while. I try not to bring the goods into the house until I've actually performed this cleansing ritual. Now personally, I do like to use a sage stick. However, you can use whatever you like. I'll let the pieces ear out for a little bit, usually a day or so outside. And when it's time, I will individually take each item out of the bag and I will just go around it with the smoke from my sage stick or incense. And basically what I'm doing is just removing any negativity, trauma, anything that is stuck on the piece that does not serve me. I believe that everything carries energy, both living and non-living things. And I believe that that energy is not always the most positive. So before I bring something into my house that was once a uh, belonging of another individual, I like to cleanse that energy off of it. This is thrifting. We are purchasing secondhand goods, items that have already been used, loved, you know, cherished by others. We don't know what these items have gone through. We don't know the individuals that own these items. We're not sure what happened while that individual had these items in their possession. The former owner could have been a wonderful individual, could have been a poster child for peace, but we don't know that, right? They could have been malicious or carried ill intention, or perhaps they were sick or even depressed. They may have had harmed other people. They may have harmed children. They could have even been in debt or had poor habits, right? So this is just my method of removing unwanted nastiness from items that I purchase. And I do this with all pieces, not just clothing. I also do this with furniture and other items. And after the energetic cleanse, I then just physically cleanse it by throwing it into the washing machine or spraying it down with Lysol. This has been my way for a long time. I do this with everything from furniture all the way to my thrifted purses. I certainly hope this helped someone. I will talk to you all soon. Peace and love.